The chef cooked up an original idea when he thought he lost it all. With a food cart and a dream, Chef Mendoza mixed the flavors of Mexico and Japan. This morning, we're showing you what's on the menu at El Sushi Loco. <laughs> It's a combination where eats meets west. It's like fusion, like the stuff you find at a taco truck, that's what you actually find on our sushi. Bienvenido al El Sushi Loco. Here in Pomona, Chef Frank Mendoza and his team are serving Mexican-style sushi. They offer your traditional raw sushi rolls, but here you'll want to try the house specialties, like this roll named tocino, which means bacon in Spanish. Rice, shrimp, cream cheese, avocado, rolled up and wrapped in bacon. <laughs> A drizzle of special house-made sauces, some grilled onions, and a yellow chili pepper to finish the dish. The sushi is special, no doubt, and it's Chef Mendoza's own story that shaped El Sushi Loco into the restaurant it is today. But when I was in prison, I had lost it all. I was broke. I mean, I got 11 years in prison, rightfully so, rightfully so. And I go, I had time to think about what am I going to do with my life? After serving time for a drug conviction, he went to work with his nephew making sushi in Mexico and decided he wanted to create a new sushi concept back in his home of East L.A. I went out to Craigslist and I found this cart. It looked like a hot dog cart. It all started in 2010 with this cart, which he purchased for $1,500, his entire life savings. Chef Mendoza would sell his sushi on sidewalks across La Puente. We started to mix, you know, uh, carne asada, filets, chicken and shrimp, marinated with even our soy sauce. We dug in everything from sushi rolls. Inside and... Mm. To octopus, shrimp, a delicious fried rice, and oyster shots. Oh, salud. Salud. No alcohol. Okay? You gotta slurp down. Okay? okay. Are you ready? <laughs> you ready? I'm ready. From prison to proud owner of three El Sushi Loco locations, Chef Mendoza hopes to inspire his kids and anyone going through a tough time to not give up on themselves. The American dream is alive and well. Today, 2023, it is alive and it is well. You just have to go get it. Have you guys ever had sushi wrapped in bacon? No, Ooh, no. What an interesting yeah. combination. You got to try that yeah. Tocino roll. It was fantastic. And Frank says that he wants to become the first Michelin star chef from East L.A. You can find El Sushi Loco in La Puente, Downey, and Pomona. And when you said that we dug in, we is you. Me. <laughs> always, always. I had everything. Thank you so much, Cheryl, for the submission. Is there a restaurant that we need to know about? Here's how you submit. Go to the abc7.com slash on the menu and then tell us the name of the restaurant and where it's located. And then watch every Friday in our 6 a.m. hour to see if we profile your pick. Mark, Leslie, John, I'm just waiting for you guys to come with me. Yeah, that looked really good. I've never been invited. <laughs> That's right. Well, now you are. Until now. Bacon <laughs> makes everything better. Yes, it's it so does. Funny. I like the cutaway after he tried to get you to slurp the little shot. And then you just... <laughs> I know, I did, but I didn't want that part on camera. <laughs> That's funny. Um, hey, good morning. I mean, it all looks delicious making uh, everybody...